Singletons await their dates poolside. Georgia and Rachel are getting acquainted with theirs. I'm so hungry. Good. What, what's your favorite food? You're gonna laugh. <laughs> <laughs> avocados. Oh, I love avocados. Don't. Do you know what? I'll go away with my mates probably once a year. And uh, we go to the airport nice and early. Mm -hmm. I always get avocado smash. <laughs> yeah. I want to meet someone that I can start bringing to like family gatherings because at the moment it's just me. <laughs> it's my sister and her boyfriend and then me. So you're fifth wheeling too? No, I'm always fifth wheeling. <laughs> yeah. Gina and Tony Calamari. Thank you so much. And those are the balls of love. Thank you. Thank you. Really great balls. Thanks. <laughs> You were just saying like to the second date. <laughs> this is moving quick. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> My friend's on a date over there. Which one? The one with the long hair. Oh yeah, yeah. The guy in the green shirt. <laughs> So now, I want to hear my story. We're going to be here a while. <laughs> I've been doing oh, the same job for five years. What's that? Estate agency. Oh, OK, right, yeah. Do you worry about telling people what you do? Oh, I so worry about telling people what I do, because no one likes estate agents. People think we're dishonest, that we're going to lie to them, <laughs> but it's totally the opposite. I'm actually quite nice and I'm honest. <laughs> So tell me about your past relationships. Mm. It's a bit of a mix, really. Not shock you totally. I was with a girl okay. for like six, seven years. She was like my best friend. And then it broke down after a while because I think we grew apart a little bit. But I was with guys before that. You wouldn't like say you've like bisexual, it's just no, a bit of a f phase. I wouldn't leave myself as anything. I don't feel like I have to put a label on myself as to, you know, I, I like both or I like one or the other. I think it's, you know, if, if someone takes my fancy, they take my fancy. I didn't expect that at all. Oh, Grant, have you seen my table? Girls over there and the other girls over there. Yeah. They kind of like each other. But then the girl here, she even likes the guy that was in front of her. So the girls that are on dates with the guys? Yeah. Like each other? Yeah. Oh! So, tell me about your dating history then. <laughs> I've made really bad choices. Bad boys? So the flowers tonight, oh my God. <laughs> no one's ever done Obviously that. Obviously knew you'd be special. No. Oh, <laughs> That's really nice. I should probably tell you <laughs> that um, I'm actually bisexual. I've always found women attractive, but I was never honest and open enough to admit to myself that that's what the situation was. So when I finished with my ex, I just decided to explore that avenue. Nice. So that's what I did. But girl on girl action. <laughs> Yeah. I guess I just see the beauty in a woman, but I want to be with a man for my long-term partner. I feel an immense connection with guys. It's always nice to have a guy to say, like, oh, you look great today, babe. Uh -huh. What's your plan? He's so nice. He's lovely. His personality is amazing. You look like you're having a light now. I'm here, mate. Like... I know, he's very easy to talk to. Blaine, is it? Robbie. Robbie, nice yeah. to meet you. Georgia knows your day. Yeah, she does, yeah. Rachel's really cool. I really like her. Like, really clicking her, and I'm getting that vibe. I, just, I don't know what to do, cos I do... He is nice. He's very... Oh, I just don't know what to do. <laughs> I'd quite like to sit down and have a chat with you, to be honest. <laughs> I think we'd have quite a good night, to be fair. I think we'd have had a good night. Let's go and sit back down. Right, see ya. Oh, yeah? <laughs> What's next? I had a question now when my friend showed me her on social media. And she's even better in person. Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.